Here we go, 12,636. We've got the monster Thanksgiving Day monster. And happy Thanksgiving Day to everyone tomorrow. I think it's the official day. In, uh, I think tomorrow's the official day. I don't think today is, but either way. So we'll start off with the two nicer packs, the TC and the credentials. For the pack bundle, hopefully we get some cool knees. We got a Ricard Raquel, rookie for the Ducks, and this would have been nice if it was the other one, but still nice. A rookie jersey auto for the Avalanche, Michael Scarbosa. Michael Scarbosa. I saw the Avalanche logo, and I thought that might have been McKinnon, and I was like, that would have been damn sweet. Credentials. Star of the night of Meg David for the Oilers. And we've got a Dennis Gilbert rookie for the Hawks to $9.99. Gilbert. Gilbert. We've got for the Maple Leafs Andreas Borgman. Andreas Borgman. We've got a game jersey for the Carolina Hurricanes, Victor Rask. No, normally that's about two weeks before release. That's when we'll get the uh, the list. So I anticipate that'll be in about a week or two, probably. And we've got for the Oilers, number to 99, winning materials, dual jersey gold, Grant Fuhrer. Grant Fear. Lafreniere will be in Series 1, yes. Uno 100%. We've got a graded 9 young guns of Jared Palmer for the Minnesota Wild. Graded 9 young guns. We've got a 9 5 young guns of Andre Kostitsin for the Habs. <clears throat> cool, Steetson. And we've got a nine graded future watch auto for the Nashville Predators, Vladislav Kamenev. Graded nine future watch auto, Vladislav Kamenev. All right, on to the retail or the, uh, sorry, the Heroes and Prospects. Uh, only for Lafreniere. We got a game used jersey, Scott Glenny. I believe that's the Dallas Stars, remember correctly. Scott Glenny. I think they got an exemption for him. And we've got for the Islanders, Nino Niederreiter. But I believe they only got the uh, the go ahead for Lafreniere. So, which again, kudos to the NHL for allowing that to happen. Because that uh, in itself is also a very nice thing to allow. All right, now we got a whole bunch of the retails. Let's get some big young guns. So the rules are still the exact same. Yeah, Walmart's are getting cleaned out. It's a good and bad thing. It's nice, like obviously it's nice if they support stores, but it's nice when people are buying that much. Marky rookie rainbow of Panarin for the Hawks. So I don't mind it either way. Garrett Sparks, Young Guns for the Maple Leafs. Yeah, that's what I meant, the NHLPA. I mean, it's nice that they allowed that. Young Guns for the Rangers of Brady Shea. Nick Shore, Portraits for the uh, LA Kings. Peter Straka, Young Gun for the Flyers. I wonder, though, if they would have to get the NHL approval for any logos, though, on the card. I wonder if that would be NHL or NHLPA. Gold Oban, Marky, rookie for the Sharks. Don Skoy, retro rookie for the San Jose Sharks. 
We've got a rookie jersey for the Hawks of Ryan Hartman. Rookie jersey, Hawks, Ryan Hartman. We've got a Lou Cheat for the LA Kings OPT update. We got a Slepeshev update retro or sorry, retro rookie for the Oilers. Kyle Bond portraits for the Hawks. Daniel Sprong portraits for the Penguins. We've got a Linus Omar Young Guns for the Sabres. Yeah, so as of right now, ladies and gentlemen, I can tell you November 5th will be Series 1. Canvas of Stepniak for the Devils. I believe we have nothing until mid-December after that. Gustav Olofsson Young Guns. Or I believe maybe Synergy. Synergy might get uh, snuck in there by end of November. Edmondson for the St. Louis Blues, Marky Rookie. Abdul Cater, Canvas for the Red Wings. But everything's going to get pushed back. Just slightly, obviously. Ryan Johansson, Canvas for the Blue Jackets. Mark Alt, Young Guns for the Flyers. Connor Breakley for the Panthers, Marky Rookie. Like, clear cut is now going to be February, by the way. So that's a long time before a clear cut comes out. We got a Marky, or sorry, Portrait of Ehlers for the Jets. Artifacts will probably be late December, early January. Randall for the Boston Bruins, Marky Rookie. And a Bukestad for the Panthers. That would be my guess. Alright. Moving on down to the east side. Anyone do anything fun uh, today, by the way? Series 1 will be sold out by November. <laughs> I can assure you, the hype around this Series 1, and especially with the French uh, Young Gun, Dre Kajula Young Guns for the Oilers, it will be insane. We got a game jersey of Ryan Kessler. <laughs> Anaheim Ducks game jersey. Young Guns canvas for the Anaheim Ducks of Larson. Larson Young Guns canvas. We got a Strom Young Guns for the Coyotes. Patrick Line Retro Rookie for the Jets. Canvas of Taves for the Hawks. Sergachev Retro Rookie for the Habs. The only way Series 1 ever gets delayed is if they had massive like printer issues. Portraits Rookies of Buchnevich for the Rangers. So, again, it's 2020, so anything's possible, but Portraits Rookies of Eric's Neck for the Minnesota Wild. But I can tell you they pretty much will nail that date. Troy Stetcher for the Vancouver Canucks, Young Guns. Dominic Simone for the Pittsburgh Penguins, Young Guns. A.J. Greer for the Avalanche, Marky Rookie. To be honest, though, it's not even necessarily, Derek, uh, about autographs. At this point, it's about printer and all that fun stuff. Marky, rookie of Kevin LeBong for the Sharks. Because certain uh, businesses have to shut down or delay or 
you know, if there's any infection there, it's crazy. Schmaltz for the Hawks, Marky Ricky. Like, if one person gets COVID at that plant who does the uh, packaging, Cal Connor for the Winnipeg Jets, Marky Ricky. We're basically going to shut that sucker down for a while, right? Mike Hoffman, Canvas. For the uh, bank. Is it Vancouver? Ottawa, right? Ottawa, there you go. Saw the Vancouver logo and I got really confused. Canvas of Giordano for the Calgary Flames. Freddy Gauthier, Young Guns for the Maple Leafs. Like, I'll give you an example, Derek. I wouldn't be surprised if Clear Cut's delayed because they can't get enough one touches. Brandon Carlo for the Boston Bruins, Young Guns. Portraits, rookies of Strom for the Coyotes. Lucic for the Oilers. Update. Portraits, rookies of Aho for the Canes. And a marquee rookie rainbow of the Lappin for the Devils. Like I said, I wouldn't be surprised on clear cut if that is one of the many issues that they're having. Is that they maybe just can't get the uh, the volume of? Did I know how many uh, one touches we go through and how hard it is to be getting those for the last few months? I can only imagine it is for clear cut. Like what is that? 20, 30, 40 thousand one touches? There's no way they could probably even get that. Well, the good news is Derek. What's going to end up happening? Is a series, well, not even if Series 1 gets delayed, because even after Series 1 comes out, there's still about a month between a big product. Products are already running out right now. It's crazy. Canvas for the Rangers of DC. I'm telling you, COVID is like the biggest hobby cleanse I've ever seen. Portrait of Couturier for the Flyers. It is like severely drying up all older stuff, which is phenomenal. Shining Stars of Taylor Hall for the Devils. I've never seen anything like it before. Carter Rowney for the Penguins, Young Guns. Base. There won't be too many redemptions. Yeah, that's what you're hoping for. Wenberg for the Blue Jacket, Shining Stars. Portrait of Ovechkin for the Caps. Young Guns Canvas, Evgeny Sveshnikov. I think Series 1 is going to very, very quickly explode. Yes. Again, sell out is a different terminology because it is already sold out from Upper Deck's point of view. But obviously, like, I'll be able to get some probably a couple weeks after release just at a higher price. Like... Obviously, 15, 16 series one we still have. Yamamoto, Young Guns for the Oilers. So sold out is relative, but I mean, uh, no, we never really sell out. John Gillies, Young Guns for the Calgary Flames. Because I'll keep bringing it in. Until people stop paying a certain amount, I'll keep bringing it in. Forsberg for the Preds. Canvas of Marshawn for the Boston Bruins. But I can tell you, like, our pre-orders are very close to selling out already. So we're almost done on that. Game jersey of Gal Cheniak. And that's much, much more ahead of where I thought it would be. Considering of, like, the previous years. Canvas for the LA Kings of Jonathan Quick. Young Guns, John Hayden for the Chicago Blackhawks. John Hayden. Shining Stars Rainbow for the Penguins. Sidney Crosby. Base. Ian McCaution, Young Guns for the Panthers. At this point, Laura, I would uh, recommend doing Hobby. Jack Eichel Portraits for the Sabres. I don't think there's too much of a discrepancy in the pricing to warrant not getting the hobby. Shining Stars of Ryan Johansson for the Preds. 
But like in a couple months from now, if, if retail is like ninety nine dollars and hobby is one hundred like seventy nine, then I would say maybe do retail. But at this point, I think hobby is your best bet. And I can promise you, it is definitely going to be as cheap as it is now than it ever will be. Curve foot young guns for the avalanche. You're only going to spend more money the weeks you wait after the. Uh... Like to give you an idea, for example, just a random idea. We pre-sold Premier for two thirty-nine ninety-nine. It is now I think two seventy-nine or two eighty-nine. And my next buy on that. I can tell you it's it's gonna probably be 300 or about 310. It's like that's basically the state of where it is right now. So my recommendation is if you want to find some series one, I would grab it now before like where's that? Ours is gonna sell out very quickly. We're almost done. So Corey Perry for the Dallas Stars update. You might as well grab it sooner than later. Canvas of Kucherov for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Marky Rookie for the Islanders of Wallstrom. Young Guns, Loisterinen for the Carolina Hurricanes. Canvas of Franz Nielsen for the Red Wings. Young Guns, Barrett Hayton for the Coyotes. Barrett Hayton. Portraits, Rookies of Kubalik for the Hawks. Marky, Rookie for the Oilers of Joaquin Nygaard. Marky, Rookie for the Devils of Gusev. Um, if you're ordering from us, you can give us a call and you can just do a deposit if you want. Ram Pitlick for the Preds, Young Guns, if you want. Canvas for the Chicago Blackhawks of Alex the Brinkett. So you can give us a call on Tuesday if you want to get a case and we can do a deposit only. Jack Hughes for the Devils, Portraits. Marky Rookie Blue, Noah Dobson for the Islanders. Marky Rookies of Kirby Doc for the Hawks. Young Guns for the Golden Knights, Nicholas Hag. Truba for the Rangers, Kansas. Hopefully I help you out with that. Gold border of Kadri for the Avalanche. Portraits rookies of Hag for the Golden Knights. Young Guns of Neil Bemstrom for the Jackets. Rookie Jersey. For the Blue Jackets, Elvis Merzlikens. Elvis Merzlikens. Portraits rookies of Boke Fist for the Hawks. Andrew Peak for the Blue Jackets, Young Guns. Marky Rookie of Connor Clifton for the Boston Bruins. And the big finish. Marky Rookie of Gaten Haas for the Oilers. All right. Yeah, it is funny because I, I'm, I'm looking at this year and the Shane Wright year. Very similar to like a Matthews, not obviously McDavid, but it still blows my mind. Like, look at what the price of Series 1 is for Matthews year and McDavid year. We're, I'm trying to tell you guys, buy the stuff now before it gets to that price. It will get there. We are not open tomorrow, but I will be doing blog. 125 dual jersey for the Avalanche. Nathan McKinnon.
We've got a 299 Zach McEwen for the Vancouver Canucks. <laughs> That's awesome, Justin. That's awesome. 99 Emerald of Radulov for the Dallas Stars. Two boxes, nice. We've got number 165 Braid and Point. He'll have fun uh, getting into the hobby. I said, it's growing. And I appreciate that, honestly. I really do. It means a lot when people refer to our site. It means a lot to us. Six ninety nine of Tavares for the Maple Leafs. No worries. Just make sure you send us an email so Dan can put them aside. Rookie Redemption! Anaheim Ducks. If you don't mind doing that, that'll help us out. Ooh, these are rare to get. An Orem autograph, number to 13, Evgeny Kuznetsov. Beautiful cards, super hard to hit. Evgeny Kuznetsov, number to 13. I think it's 13, right? Yeah, 13. Are there discounts in all honesty? Like... You can give us a call on Tuesday and I can talk to you about it. $3.99, Rudolph Balsers. It, it would be very minimal, to be completely honest. And I'm just trying to be straight up with you and candid with you on that. But I would happily try to shave off what I can. But I don't think it would be a lot, just so you know. Like, pre, like Snow Word of a Lie Series 1 and SBA... For example, are the two easiest pre-sales we have. It's like everybody wants them. So it's not one of those ones where, you know, we know we might be stuck with some. It, it's it's going to fly. It's already flying right now. Moments of McDavid for the Oilers. It would just also be a matter, to be honest, uh, Laura, is whether we can actually do that many cases. We actually are probably running very low, as I said. Stevenson for the Vegas Golden Knights. Like, for example... As we've talked, I just saw that we sold a case and two boxes of it. Moments of Bennington for the Blues. So obviously all of that is taking uh, taking stuff down, right? Bobrovsky Red Limited for the Florida Panthers. Perfect. SP Essentials of Kachuk for the Calgary Flames. I think Lafreniere will probably start off around the 200. If I had to guess, 200-ish. Patrick Kane for the Hawks. The thing that I think is going to put it over the edge is what will that French young gun go for? And again, since there's no checkers, we don't know if the canvas is in number one or two. We got an Islanders red of Honors Lee and a Joel Person for the Edmonton Oilers. Yeah, like I wouldn't be surprised if it's like the first few saw around 300 bucks. But like the French young gun is probably going to be five to seven. Patrick Kane, red for the Hawks. I honestly anticipate this being a $150 box within about three weeks. That would be my guess. SP Essentials of Kotkin Yemi for the Habs. Cam Atkinson, update for the Blue Jackets. Young Guns, and a good one to get graded. Igor Shesterkin. Igor Shesterkin. <laughs> We've got a moment of paling for the Habs. That French young gun is also going to be probably very limited to get. Linus Omar for the Buffalo Sabres. The second that we get the checklist, we will let you know. Spectrum FX for the Capitals of Alex Ovechkin. That is also why I recommend if you don't uh, follow us on Facebook or whatever it is. Spectrum uh, FX Future Watch of Emil Bemstrom for the Jackets. We post immediately the second that we get the checklist on our Facebook. So it gives you guys an update. Future Watch Auto for the Montreal Canadiens. Caden Primo. So it'd probably be good to follow us on Facebook. 
We've got a redemption, Martin Fairberry. Well, that's my point, right? You see, like, two of those young guns in the case. You know how, like, obviously including the checklist, there's 50. So basically every 25 cases, if it's perfectly collated, you get one Lafreniere. SP Essentials of Miro Heiskanen. Do you mind filling this up? So, like, that's pretty, uh... Hello, Anna, everyone says. No? Okay. She doesn't know how to say hi. She's doesn't speak very good English right now. Anna looks nice. Don't let looks deceive you, my friend. Who is that? That is Anna. She does, uh, she's mean, yeah. She does, uh, she basically works with Ashley on a lot of stuff for accounting. So. We got a moment of Patrick Kane for the Hawks. We've got a Mitch Marner Spectrum for the Maple Leafs. You as well, Terry, you as well. Matthew Joseph, Future Watch Spectrum for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Bo Horvat, Red for the Vancouver Canucks. She's been with us for like four months, so. We've got a Future Watch Auto for the Ottawa Senators, Maxime Lajoie. Is she the Gobble Monster? Are you the Gobble Monster? Fun. What was the one thing we first debated about? What's how do you say his, uh what's the guy's name? Brady? Huh? No. Brady who? On Ottawa. What was the last name? Kachuk. Kachuk. Is it Kachuk? Kachuk? It's not Kachuk. Kachuk. She's she's uh she's Russian, right? There we are. No. What are you again? Ukrainian. Ukrainian. Yeah. And I had to show him and you give me Kuznetsov. 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 Kachuk. We got a Hagland for the LA Kings. Update. And don't make that mistake again. <laughs> Blue Jackets, Red of Panarin. But no, if you guys are uh, lucky to see her in store, she's awesome. She's been with us for four months. I'm hoping she's with us for a very long time. Dylan Strom, Chicago Blackhawks. Update. She is awesome. We got a Cogliano for the Dallas Stars. Update. Moments of Eric Stahl for the Minnesota Wild. Ryan O'Reilly for the Blues, red. Well, you know what I did for her, B. Golden? Which I thought she would like, but she didn't. Milestones of Kachuk for the Calgary Flames. is uh, In Goodwin Champion, there's a Ukraine uh, map card. I actually got her one of those, and she basically threw it out. That's the appreciation level I got. Moment of the Golden Knights. I thought that would be kind of cool. You get a little Ukraine uh, card. Milestones of Eichel for the Buffalo Sabres. <laughs> Mason Appleton for the Winnipeg Jets. They all want to know why I threw it out. They all want to know why you threw out my card. Winnipeg Jets line A. You got an answer to it. Milestones of he sure for the Devils. Why did you throw my card? What card? The Ukraine card. I have it. In a box. No. Oh, okay. It's slabbed. Slabbed? Sweet. Future watch. Uh, okay, I gotta, I'll lock the door right after this. Future watch auto patch number to 25 for the Blues, Robert Thomas. Robert Thomas, number to 25. One second, I'm coming out. And then it's one off his jersey number. Woohoo! Okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna let her out. Let the animal out of the cage. I'll be back.
scary neighborhood. Walk her to her car, no. Although, I will say, there's something flashing right outside of her parking lot on the ground. So I don't know if that's a bomb or if it's just like a headlight from a bike. Might have to check that out later. I guess we'll find out. And I'm not even lying. There is like something flashing outside on the ground. So, we will see. We've got a retro of Get Slap for the Ducks. Matt Murray for the Penguins. Marky Rookie. We've got, that's a nice one, an orange. Number to 49 rainbow for the Blues of Tarasenko. Tarasenko. Uh, give me one second, guys. I do apologize. She forgot her laptop. She just messaged me. You all forgot something, out. Huh? All right, anyways. We've got a white ice for the Winnipeg Jets, Andre Pavlich. Andre Pavlich. We've got a team logos for the Avalanche of Ginla. Gustav Olafsson for the Minnesota Wild. We got a rainbow, Oscar Lindbergh, uh, rainbow for the Rangers. Chandler Stevenson for the Caps. <laughs> We've got a Miko Rontanen, marquee rookie for the Avalanche. And a Vertanen for 149 for the Vancouver Canucks. To be fair, though, be golden. I bet if you lived in Montreal, it'd be pretty uh, big Montreal heads up there, too, right? We've got an Athanasiu uh, rookie for the Red Wings and a Matt Quemple for the Ottawa Senators. Ottawa Senators. What's a scoop on Brody? What do you mean, what's a scoop on Brody? Rainbow of Nyquist for the Red Wings. Jan Mark for the Dallas Stars. Marky rookie. Retro of Carey Price for the Habs. And a Fucali Marky rookie for the Habs. Is he good? I'm not too sure. Rainbow of Marshawn for the Boston Bruins. Retro rookie of Fiala for the Preds. Della Rose for the Habs. Golden Hootie, what team do you think is more forgiving? The, uh, the uh, Habs or the Leafs? Rainbow of Molson for the Buffalo Sabres. Hannafin for the Carolina Hurricanes. We've got a Van Beesbrook for the Florida Panthers retro. The other thing is, Golden, I don't know what Leaf fans you talk to. I feel like uh, you might be tainted on that. Rainbow retro of Esposito for the Boston Bruins. I don't think I've ever heard anyone tell me that, like, you know, fourth liners are going to be great players. Brian Little tracks for the Jets. Brendan Gons for the Vancouver Canucks. Maybe you just talk to different people. We got a Lucic for the LA Kings tracks. Sprong for the Pittsburgh Penguins marquee rookie. Ah, uh, Laurent, I unfortunately because I'm the only one here now. Retro rookie of Eichel for the Sabres. Don Skoy for the San Jose Sharks. So I cannot, if you want to send us an email, I can get Dan to reply to you. Pavelski for the Sharks, team logos. Brock McGinn for the Canes, Marky Rookie. We got a Superstars of Jamie Benn for the Dallas Stars. Well, to be fair, though, Golden, 
Retro of Hellebuck for the Jets, Mike McCarron for the Montreal Canadiens. In the same asylum that you uh, currently reside in, maybe that you know you shouldn't be asking your neighbors about that. I don't think they would know. Because I would tell you that person needs some help if they think MacArthur would score 60. <laughs> it is a good place to live. I feel like we also sometimes, I'm not going to lie, I feel like every every team does this. But I feel like sometimes they might just troll you just to troll you. So maybe you just got suckered into it. Like, I'm not going to lie, I think I would do the same thing to you. Like, I, I do think TJ Brody actually might be the first defenseman to get 50 goals next year. We got a puck persona as a patch ready for the Habs. Connect me for the Flyers. There's something you can grab after. We've got a Trevor Carrick for the Carolina Hurricanes marquee rookie. And the Ottawa Senators, Eric Carlson to 199 Rick Prism. I, I will tell you, at least from the fans that I've talked to, there's not much expectations for Brody right now, which is good for him. Rainbow of McKinnon for the Avalanche. Sergachev for the Montreal Canadiens marquee rookie. NHL logo, Kress of Zetterberg for the Red Wings. I actually do think Tyson Berry is going to have a very good year next year with uh, Edmonton. I do firmly believe that. Tracks of Tatar for the Red Wings. Kachuk for the Calgary Flames, Mark Yorkie. He'll probably get uh, power play time with Drace Otto McDavid. Erickson Eck for the Minnesota Wild retro rookie. Larson for the Ducks. So I think his numbers are going to be boosted up for sure. Retro rookie of Morrissey for the Jets. Leap sick for the Maple Leafs, Marky rookie. Yep. We got a rainbow retro of Tavares for the Islanders. Buchnevich for the Rangers. To be honest, right now I think Brody, there's not much expectations for him. I really think that, honestly. We've got for the Vancouver Canucks, Jake Vertanen. I feel like he flies under the radar. Now, if it was like Petrangelo or Krug, I think the expectations would, would be like he's got to be our best defenseman. I don't feel like with Brody, people really feel that way. Rainbow of Jones for the Sharks. Fashing for the Buffalo Sabres. Rainbow uh, rookie of Krause for the Coyotes. VC marquee rookie for the Rangers. Tracks of Goose uh, uh, Nyquist, sorry, yeah, Nyquist for the Red Wings. I had somebody tell me that they were unhappy with how the, the Sens have done it. I, I thought that Sens have done great this offseason. Duchesne for the Avalanche. Nylander, Marky, rookie for the Leafs. Retro of Kucherov for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Kasperi Kapanen for the Maple Leafs. The problem with trades, though, is you can never look at it as the after and, and, and ignore everything else. Logo crest of Crosby for the Penguins. The trade when it happened was a very favorable trade for Toronto. Most people will tell you that. The thing is, it didn't work out very favorable for Toronto. Rainbow of Kessel for the Pittsburgh Penguins. Strom for the Coyotes. Marquee rookie for the Maple Leafs of Connor Brown. Michael Matheson retro rookie. For the Florida Panthers. I can guarantee you that. Yes. Derek Stepan for the Rangers. Retro. We've got a seismic gold of Burakovsky to 50. Burakovsky. Taylor Hall went to Buffalo. I did not hear that. I was literally about to ask if anything happened today or even yesterday. I obviously have been too worked up on other stuff. Marky, rookie of Braden Point for the Tampa Bay Lightning. And a red prism rookie auto of Miles Wood, number to 50. One year in Buffalo. What did he sign for? Oh, is, sorry. Did you? That, that's what the 8 mil was. Wow, sorry about that. Yeah, that's uh, You think that's a good deal, eh? 8 million for him. Interesting. I think it's a fair deal. I don't know if it's a good deal.
Actually, the one I was very curious about, maybe uh, you as a Sens fan, you can tell me about this. Why was Bobby Ryan not... Like, what was up with Bobby Ryan? Did he just not want to come back, or what happened there? Why does Hall get shipped around a lot? To be honest, at a certain point, you got to think that maybe uh, Hall as a dressing room player is maybe not the best person to have around. I'm just saying, if a player moves around from team to team to team, generally that's probably sometimes what the issue is. Shabbat for the Ottawa Senators. Green. And a nice premier's jersey of Brady Kachuk. Brady Kachuk. Yeah, it kind of surprises me on that. Like, I, th I, I thought that was a great story at the end of the year. And I thought he was going to come back and do great. Green of Eric Stahl for the Wild. Michael McLeod to 9.99 Ice Mirrors for the Devils. Green of Aho for the Canes. 4.99 Philip Horonic for the Red Wings. Monahan for the Calgary Flames. Green. Austin Matthews, sub zero for the Maple Leafs. McDavid Green for the Oilers. 499 of Euro Vacaninen for the Boston Bruins. Green of Carlson for the Golden Knights. We got a sub zero auto, Warren Fogel. Warren Fogel. And we got a nice Premier's jersey for the Detroit Red Wings, Dominic Turgeon. Yeah, I don't mind that deal, though. That is, uh, that's a good point about lifting the pressure off. I think Taylor Hall, honestly, will fit decently well in Buffalo. I do. I just don't know if I consider $8 million a steal or a good deal. I feel like it's, a, it's pretty much... Honestly, I don't know. I even feel it might be a slight overpayment, in my opinion. We've got number to 35 exclusives autograph for the Tampa Bay Lightning, Andre Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky, number to 35. Ian, how you doing, sir? So obviously I might be out of the loop, but Petrangelo, where is he still somewhere or just hasn't been? So Golden, in your opinion, do you think that pushes Buffalo into the playoffs though? Especially since it's a one-year deal. He went to Vegas. Wow. Man, how does Vegas land all these guys? Wow. We've got a Bennington for the Blues, Orange, and an Ice Premier's a Brady Keeper for the Florida Panthers. Party town, apparently, eh? We've got a Goudreau Green for the Calgary Flames, 149 for the Flyers of Faraby, Ice Premier's, and a Michael Dow Cole to 299 for the Islanders. Ice Premier's Retro, or whatever you want to call it. We've got a Bergeron Green for the Boston Bruins. And a Sub-Zero Rookie Auto for the Kings, Carl Grundstrom. Carl Grundstrom. We've got a San Jose Sharks Logan Couture Green, $9.99 for the Red Wings of Giovanni Smith. Is that true? No income, income tax in Vegas? He share for the Devils Green, $4.99 of Jonathan Davidson for the Sens. That's pretty incredible if there's none. They pay a luxury tax. Do you know what that tax is or how does it work?
We've got for the Tampa Bay Lightning tonight, 65 Iconic Fabrics, Steven Stamkos. Oh, okay, so it's still both federal. Steven Stamkos. We've got an Ultimate Rookies jersey to 125 of Noah Hannafin. Noah Hannafin. For the Rangers, number 99 jersey, Henrik Lundqvist. Henrik Lundqvist. For the Carolina Hurricanes, the 299, Brad Pesci. Rookie Auto, Brett Pesci. And we've got 299 for the Sharks, Don Scoy, Rookie Auto. That definitely has to factor into some players who sign massive deals, eh? The amount of money that they get taxed in certain places versus others, it's got to be a pretty sizable difference, I'd have to guess. Ultimate 14-15. Actually, one thing I just noticed. Can someone double-check that there's a 17-18 premiere? Because I feel like I forgot that. Too. I swear I put three premieres in this. For the Winnipeg Jets, Blake Wheeler to 299. For the Habs, Ben at three ghetto. 299. I love these cards. Obsidian Script Patch Auto. Number to 25 for the Devils, Damon Severson. So it is 17, 18. Beautiful. I'll go grab that quickly after this. Damon Severson. Huh. That's kind of funny. Debut Threads Patch for the Devils. Damon Severson, Insta PC. Severson, twelve twenty-five. Merry Christmas for the Boston Bruins Ultimate Collection jersey to ninety-nine of Bergeron. And we got a Penguins to one fifty. Sidney Crosby. Well, I'll do those three boxes, and then I'll go grab, uh, or, yeah, three boxes. Statue. And a reminder, folks, we do have other breaks up there. We'd love to get them as uh, all done as possible. The cup is up there. We got Premier. We got Ultimate. I can't remember what else, but we got other stuff. For the Habs, Larry Robinson. I think we have Stature. So. For the Winnipeg Jets, Blake Wheeler. Blake Wheeler. For the Ottawa Senators, Brandstrom to 399. Brandstrom, 399. For the Ottawa Senators, the 149 Green, Vitaly Abramov. Abramov Green. We got a red number to 45 esteemed of Joe Thornton. Jumbo Joe. He hasn't gone anywhere, has he? Joe Thornton. For the Devils, rookie reliance autograph, Nakita Gusev. Rookie reliance auto, Gusev. He had to bet. Number 10 of 20, esteemed blue of Jonathan Tace. Tace. 
And we got a Makar Reliance for the Avs. I feel like Splendor would give you a better overall value, in my opinion. Buybacks is phenomenal, but you normally get one big card and then, uh, like, three or four semi-decent cards. Splendor, I feel like all the cards will... The lower Splendor cards are also the lower buyback cards. Let me put it that way. We've got number 199 for the Bruins, Patrice Bergeron. And as stated, by the way, in the thread, this should be the big case hit. I would guess, because unless this case is absolutely sucky. Meh. Apparently it's absolutely sucky. My apologies. Number three of four. Canvas autograph. I can get that card to move a bit. Oh, yeah, easy. Three of four for the Oilers. Connor Mick. David. Three of four. McDavid. Well, Ed Money, congrats. Whoever has Edmonton, you just got McDavid. McDavid did? McDavid's? How would you say that one? Be golden, how are we going to say that one? You just got McDavid in? You just got the McDavid's? Eh. Well, right when I say that, uh, what do you call it? Buybacks might be a better value than Splendor. It reminds me why buybacks is phenomenal. And this reminds me why Splendor is phenomenal. Not going to lie, I don't know the year this guy played. One of one. Cut signatures for the Maple Leafs Buzz Bowl. Does anyone want to give me some information on this man when he played? One of one cut signature buzz bowl. Buzz bowl. Damn. Now that is some back to back monsters. Eleven seasons. 1933. Holy jeez, that's a look. Okay, I'll go grab the premiere, guys. Wow. That is some vintage stuff right there. So we got a cut out on a McDavid. So premiere, you better live up to some good hype now. All right, so the top two teams just got covered. What's the next top uh, team? Vancouver. So Vancouver must have a big card in here. We've got for the Carolina Hurricanes a 3 9 Hayden Flurry. Hayden Flurry. For the Devils, a 3 9 Jesper Bratt. Jesper Bratt. Four, that's a sexy patch. The 199 rookie patch auto for the Avalanche. Tyson Jost. 199 for the Avalanche. Tyson Jost. Beautiful. We've got for the Habs, Premier Signature Champions in 99, Kirk Muller. Kirk Muller. We've got for the Carolina Hurricanes, Magnificent Marks of Hayden Fleury. Carolina. A Mega Patch. Chest logos numbered to 22. 
for the Anaheim Ducks, Brandon Montour. Number to 22, Brandon Montour. And we got for the Blues, Vince Dunn. Vince Dunn. 16 Sheraton. In other not hockey news, and obviously no spoilers, but I just finished season three of Ozark. That was a phenomenal show. Anyone who has not watched Ozark, by the way, I highly recommend investing some of your time into that. What a phenomenal show. For the Coyotes, Max Domi. $3.99. We've got for the Oilers a $1.99. Paul U. Yarvey. $1.99. Paul Yarvey. That's a good rookie. $2.99. Rookie patch auto for the Canes. Sebastian Aho. <laughs> Stupid question. I'm guessing they obviously filmed it in the Ozarks, right? I'm guessing they would have filmed in the Ozarks. They do. For the Avalanche, number 49. Base, uh, base autograph, Matt Duchesne. I would love to know how much that's helped the economy for them. Like certain places there, if it's like helped it massively. We've got for the Panthers, signature booklets. Roberto Luongo. You can't get into it, really. Wow. That surprises me. Roberto Luongo. And we got for the Blue Jackets, Oliver Bjorkstrand. Jennifer, when did you stop watching it, out of curiosity? Because I will tell you, it literally gets better the longer it goes. Like, it's way more intriguing and in-depth the longer it's gone. So I'm saying if you kind of quit after two, three episodes, I think you would... Uh... But if it's like you tried, you know, a season and a half, your season two, in my opinion, killed season one, and season three killed season two. <laughs> we got for the Coyotes rookie of Max Domi. Ozark was life-changing. Oh, it was life-changing, but it's a damn good show. Athanasius, see you to three ninety-nine. I will tell you, man, the actors are phenomenal in there. Holy geez, some of those guys uh, and girls should be winning awards. For the Penguins, three ninety-nine. Sidney Crosby. Yeah, I, I. Whether you want to try it or not, Jennifer, I'll try going back to it. It, it honestly gets significantly more interesting. For the Sharks, the three ninety nine Joe Pavelski. Joe Pavelski. We've got a Spectrum rookie patch auto for the Flyers, number to sixty five. Nick Cousins. You know what? Who honestly impressed me the most? And obviously, it's not a spoiler at all. But Ben. That guy is an absolutely phenomenal actor. Nick Cousins out of 65. We've got number to 49, rookie auto for the Anaheim Ducks, Nick Ritchie. Nick Ritchie. And we've got for the Capitals, 399, Stanislav Galiev. I would say his acting, like, very few times have I watched a movie and or, like, a TV show and thought, holy geez, like, that actor is, he does such a phenomenal. He, so one of the only other times, in my opinion, and again, I'm not going to pretend I'm this big movie critic or anything. It's just when I felt like the actor did it above, well above, was, uh, and I might have the name wrong, so I apologize on that, but I think it was a John Goodman. He's a bigger guy, but he, he was in the... Um, 
Cloverfield Lane, I think it was called. I think it was John Goodman. I might have the name wrong. But I remember watching and like, holy jeez, his acting was just beyond. Like, was it him? Okay. I was so impressed with it. As at very few times do I, uh, do you kind of get into it and think like, this guy is like just a straight beast in this. And Ben to me is like, last time I've had that happen. 249! Eric Stahl. Minnesota Wilds. But mind-blowing acting. Well, that's a nice one. For the Preds. Number 299. Eli Tolvanen. 99 rookie patch auto for the Nashville Predators. Tolvanen. Definitely a case at A or B with the 99 rookie patch auto for sure. Congrats, Nashville. 99 enshrinement auto of Borgstrom for the Florida Panthers. Love these cards with the acetate now. Henrik Borgstrom. For the Boston Bruins, a 249. Jeremy Lozon. Boston Bruins. And we've got a 249. Sam Steele. Steele. For the Anaheim Ducks. All right, 16 17. It's a very good break. Very good break. Uh, I don't I don't get that feel too much. But it does to you, it does to you. So everyone's different, right? On the how cards feel, on, but I don't, I don't on that one. But Kopitar two forty nine, L.A. Kings. For the Bruins two forty nine, Danton Heenan. Danton Heenan. That is a sick looking patch. For the Islanders, number to 50 limited logos patch auto, Andrew Ladd. Andrew Ladd. Beautiful patch auto. That is a sick card. Number 10 of 12. Gold autograph for the Ducks, Timu Solani. 10 of 12, Timu Solani. For the Panthers, 249, Mulligan. Base rookie. And a 249 Igor Larionov for the Red Wings. Randoms coming up in the giveaway.